Being an MLM isn't a bad thing at all to me. It's just we need to make sure we have rules in place that govern how we treat others so that people don't get screwed. What I realized was there was this opportunity to, to create an environment where people could win, where the average person had a chance. We are going to become a very unique global company that is a leader of this industry that does this business like nobody else. No longer an insignificant industry, network marketing has truly come of age. With annual sales of $178 billion and growing, network marketing is big business, very big. To put $178 billion into perspective, network marketing has more sales annually than hamburger giant McDonald's at $28 billion, the worldwide music industry at $15 billion, the movie industry at $80 billion, and even General Electric at $142 billion in annual sales. Of the $178 billion in sales, network marketing companies pay approximately 40% of its sales, or $71 billion in commissions annually, to its independent network of distributors. That's over $200 million in commissions paid out every day to entrepreneurs across the globe. Because network marketing has become so successful, there are also companies and individuals looking to inflate their income at the expense of the entrepreneurs who are building their business each day. When choosing the right opportunity, you should do so very carefully. With real effort and dedication to learning, network marketing can change fortunes, eliminate debt, and provide lifelong relationships. However, if an entrepreneur is not aware of what to look for, efforts can be wasted, commission plans can be changed without notice, and businesses permanently altered. Although there are many network marketing companies that may claim to adequately cover these four essential areas, until recently, nobody in the industry covered a very real problem the imbalance of power between corporate and the entrepreneurs building the company in the field. I was faced with that opportunity with an eight-figure bonuses for executing things in the company that I thought were wrong. But there gets to be a point, if your needs are met financially, that money is not the primary issue anymore. It's who you are, what you represent, and what you manifest. Dr. Fred Cooper and his partners refused to implement a plan in another company that would have ultimately destroyed thousands of businesses overnight. Instead, they decided to quit and leave their entire career behind and start a new company. That company is Rx. Rx founders started the company knowing the power of network marketing, but also understanding the inherent problems with human nature that accompany the ability to earn massive amounts of money. What was missing was the meaning in the relationship. Having made millions of dollars in network marketing and in the health industry, and having led companies that now have sales in the billions of dollars, RX founders wanted to tip the scales back in favor of those who build the company, the entrepreneur distributor. They wanted to give those entrepreneurs a business bill of rights that protects their efforts, their commissions, and the future of the entrepreneur's business. You get to a point in your, in your career and your job satisfaction where you get so frustrated with, with what you're doing because you see the things around you that are happening that you completely disagree with. You can only put up with that for so long. The reasons in which they and likewise myself made the decision to make a change, it was overwhelmingly uh, what, what I felt personally the right thing to do. For me, it was a point where I was no longer proud of what I was representing and the direction it was going. And I felt like the industry needed something better and needed a new example. These executives did just that. They founded Rx with the foundation built on protections for the representative. Rx representatives have a bill of rights, which isn't just marketing language. It's a part of the company's contractual agreement with the people who are building the business every day. And the fact that our representatives have specific rights and we have obligations to them is a powerful concept. And the fact that we're willing to put what we say in writing, in contractual obligation, really is the first reflection from a field that says, don't just trust me because I said it. Trust me because I put it in writing to protect you. The RX Bill of Rights has many protections and benefits unseen within the industry, such as true legal protection for your business. 
Unlike many companies, your RX business cannot be taken from you without due process. Written policies and procedures that will not change without your acceptance. RX will never leave network marketing to distribute its products through a retail business model. And RX has set aside profit sharing in each market throughout the world to reward field leaders for their country's success. To me, the, the Bill of Rights signifies fairness and equality for our representatives because they need to have more than just a voice. In addition to the Bill of Rights, you can be assured that the RX operating agreement was created with the entrepreneur in mind. If there was a standard that we wanted to write it to was we have to be willing to sign this ourselves. And if we're not willing to, how can we ask anybody else with good integrity? RX is leading the industry with these groundbreaking innovations. Other companies will be forced to step up and provide these same protections or they will not remain competitive. With a foundation rooted in protection for the representative, the RX opportunity is simple yet powerful. We market only world-class brands that are designed to improve the quality of our lives while maximizing the industry's most unique and lucrative patent-pending compensation plan. I mean, I've had teary-eyed stories of, of people who had given up and dramatically changed their life because they decided to take our products. I mean, I can't imagine a better gift. At Oryx, you have both both sides of the equation. You really do have the best compensation plan. Just educate yourself. You really do have a Deanna Ladson and products that are phenomenal. With RX, your rights are guaranteed. Your legacy is secure and our products are changing lives. I know that we have tried to create a perfect environment where if you're going to pick anywhere to get an alternative source of income, RX is your best pick.